Welcome guys back to our first episode of our heart series and it's going to be showing what we're going to be building and then we'll start doing it. So you have heart, add heart and remove heart and you got toggle, toggle between half and full. You've got three modes of hearts, um, red, blue and black. So if I add a red heart, it works. That I can also add a half red heart, then we move a full red heart, then maybe add a full red heart, then maybe add a black heart, yeah, then maybe add half a blue heart. So if I go back to add another half red heart, it will come back to this one and fill this one up and it won't just add to black. If I want to add, for example, maybe another full red heart, it will do red hearts first. And let's say I add a black heart, it will fill this one up and then add your half black heart. So it works like it does in Isaac. Um, this is an Isaac kind of heart system. It doesn't have eternal hearts. Um, they don't try to add to that. Actually, the third one. I mean, it's just how you order it. It would be more difficult to add it, um, so it, like the new system where it's kind of on top of another heart. Um, but it is possible. Uh, also, on the scripts you can change your max heart, so say we got 10. Add a heart, um, it only allows us to go up to 10, it then not allow us to go any more. Um, that is, let's say, remove few, then we add a few black beds with all kinds added together. So, like 12. Um, it's pretty easy to add. You just, this is, these are just where ads, these are just lists, I'll go into that later. But essentially what you do is you put all your hearts on here and you go full, half, full, half, full, half. Then six ones just get empty, so you can actually empty hearts. I then you get your heart list, which is just essentially all these images. And then we have a heart number, which you don't need to worry about, I'll be encoded. Hard style, you don't need to worry about, you don't need to worry about any of these, because these will all be set at the start. And, we just want to make sure the test, I believe, has to be on. I don't remember whether or not I fixed the test. Test is fixed, so I can't remove test, okay. Good. Um, I was just saying to do work with refresh, just check things are working. Next, we've got text heart and text, um, heart as I should move, which is just simply these text boxes here. So we go into this, um, it's pretty darn simplified, it's a lot of code, which is why I'm doing 20 minute episodes and so we're probably going to, right now it's 8.35, so we can go maybe 15 minutes to 8.50, and that'll be enough. Um, but yeah, I'll just go, you know, your add heart, I'll be going over this in our video. That's all the add heart. Then we have remove heart. Then we have our refresh, which that's just refreshes it. And our switches. Um, freak, I was actually meant to get something up. Uh, let me just get this off here. Actually, I should have image of it. I really was meant to get this up, but... Freak, where I put it? Um, downloads... This should be an image. Quad heart flowchart, this is it. So this is our flowchart, and this is how it works, and we'll go through this. So what we do is we, we're asking whether or not we're adding or removing. So this is our adding, this is our removing. So if we are adding, then we're coming over here, and we're asking whether or not it's a red heart, red or black or blue heart. If it's black or blue, then we go down here. If it's red, we go over here. If it's red, we're asking, do you actually have any red hearts? And if we do, what we're asking is we're asking whether or not you're half. If it is half, then we're asking whether or not you're adding half or full. And if you're adding half, then you just fill it up. And if you're adding full, let's do this. So you can kind of read how this works. If we're not adding half, uh, if, if our last one isn't half, are we are adding half or full, and we just 
go over to the corresponding one there. If we are black or blue, we're asking, do you have any black or blue? And it's the same thing. But the only difference is that they can fill up um, a last heart and add another half of your color. And obviously fill up the last heart. And this is, if we're moving, if we have any black or blue hearts, no, no, we just can't go in this loop here, so we'll kind of constantly go through these. Um, do you have any red hearts? Yes, we do. I'd say, is your last red heart half? Well, if it is, then are we are we removing half or full? If we're just at removing half, well, obviously, just can remove the heart. If we're at removing full, we want to remove the heart and we want to check whether or not it's any more hearts. And if there's any more reds, then you can move it. Otherwise, don't, right? You know, there's no need to move something. And if there isn't, then that's fine. Because, I mean, if you lose a heart, since all the black and blues will always be after the red, since black and blues before, then it'll be fine. And if you are removed, if it, is, if it is in half, then we just do the same, convert and move. If we do a black and blue, is your last one half? If it is in half, then we're checking, are you moving half or full? Um, if we're moving full, um, which is obviously a full heart, we just remove it. Otherwise, the same. So the exact same thing as we had over here, right? Then, if we, our last one is half, exact same thing, right? Exact same thing. But the only difference is that yes now does nothing. It should it? I think I may mix that. For adding full. <laughs> oh yeah. They're different questions. This one says, "In is that the last heart? And if it is the last heart, then you don't do anything. If it isn't, then convert. But this one's a bit different. So obviously, I must have done them differently. But as you see, it's quite a complex um, flow chart. So we'll be working through that. And sorry about that. Sorry about having to find all this stuff. Um, I probably should have already had it up, but I kind of went off rake and forgot about it. So we'll get jumping into the code. Um, we'll move both of these, then we'll jump over here. I will be writing the code with you guys. Um, have we start a new scene, and we'll show you how to set up. So what you want to do is you want to set up a canvas, right? And what we want to do is under this canvas, we want to have a bunch of images, right? And these don't need to be ordered. These don't need to be named. If I am just since this, you can, right? And you can just do like this a bunch of times, call this two, call this three, call this four, call this five. Obviously get these ordered up properly. So five over here. So we'll just maybe do it like how we do it on top corner and like like this. And make sure you click box mode so we can line it properly. Maybe like that, that's pretty good. And then, wow, let's just do this. Okay, thank you. And then we're gonna go back to our, oh, that's two. Freak, what's three then? That's three, so that's, goes over here. One's over here, and what's that, like four? Okay. So we actually need all these properly. Because these are the order that the things are going to come in. So I don't really care about like um, the difference, but I did actually in my last one, as you see what it looks like. Actually, these shouldn't mind if they touch, so we will just like touch them all together. Since yeah, and then we should be able to double it. Oh, obviously, double the whole thing. Just kind of adjust these upwards. I think at one too many fives. Another too many fives. So there we go. And make sure when you do this, as you see, five, four, three, two, one. Make sure this one's six. This one's seven. This one's eight. Make sure that it actually makes sense. Obviously, it will go back to front. Maybe you want that, maybe you don't. Right. 
if you want it so it fills up the first line and then goes back to the start again do it that way if you want it so it does like a zigzag kind of thing then do it that way I hope it's yes catch my mouse sorry I just had to check check I was kind of catching my mouse um sorry my macbook turned off that's why I'm getting all my code because this is a lot of code so that's not I can build myself so we can call this hearts YouTube. Okay, so that's a heart system. And then we want to select all of these. And we're just going to find our sprites and find our blank. That's our blank. And that's just how they look. They're quite big, but I, we can easily make them smaller, as you see. That's what they look like, right? Um, if we want to do it, we would have to make all these around here. You know, it's just too much. Of I mean, I'm sure we could probably do some of like that. I don't know how that works. And um, wait, does it get reset? Yeah, it does. It gets bits from like the last one. Okay. So see, um, it will climb down properly. Just double checking that. You just want to double check that. Next, we want to add a few buttons, obviously. Right. So this can be called our add, our remove, our, uh, oh my gosh, come on, switch heart, and maybe switch half, and call that. So obviously add can be maybe like, I don't know, like here-ish. Like that, uh, that's a pretty good size. This can be a good come over a bit. 200, we'll make it 200. The more 200 by 70. Like that. Let's go through them. So this is going to be add. A heart. This is going to be move a heart. This is you can obviously double click them. This is going to be um, switch to half mode, vice versa. Yeah, it kind of stops at the bottom, but that's fine. And then this one's can be. Switch current heart. And we went not mod to be on. Okay, that's good. Um, next one a bunch of text. This one is gonna be a bit longer because this is gonna be our text for our uh half. It's gonna be a bit longer, and we want to make sure it's mid, and we're gonna say. Adding slash removing a half. We'll say I will always say full fat. Alright, and then what we'll do is we will we'll make it bigger. That and we'll also give it a better color like that. And then we'll copy and paste this and. We're going to call this text heart. And we'll say red. Like that. And we could put this to like maybe like, I don't know, like a bluish. So that's what it looks like. I don't know, maybe you don't like that. Who cares? It doesn't really matter, right? Uh, I am going to make this black because I like black backgrounds. So it's going to look a bit better. Um, and it's a bit more contrasted too, which makes it look a bit nicer. Contrast always makes it look nice. So, um, these images I image the can't speak badly. These images I will be putting in the description. Um, in the description. I will be putting them on my site. So if you want to check those out, go to my site. Um, the reason I won't just I'll, put, I'll upload them to a like media file, but I'll put the link on my site and probably in the description too. Um, they're, they're, like, 
the, just a collection I got from Google Images, right? I didn't really spend time, and they're not probably royalty free, but I barely could find these. They're really hard to find. I mean, the black hearts were really hard, and obviously you can't pick up black half black hearts, so I had to split them. I could have probably got the high spirit heart from um, uh, Remix, but I forgot about that, and I probably could have just converted all the colors to black, but I forgot about that, so we're just gonna obviously <laughs> change along. It's continuing. So what we're going to do is we're going to build a few scripts. But we're basically there. So let's just set up this round. Um, we will kind of get the scripts forward. Uh, and so we want one called our... We're just going to call this hearts, right? Uh, maybe like... Heart. We'll call it heart. And maybe like a heart handler or a... Um, heart manager. How about that? Make sure you have no space bars. They will make up, make up, mess up your thing. Um, so with heart, just remove that and make sure it says system dot serializable like that. And I believe you don't put a yeah you don't put that. So that's all we need, and we don't need any of this. So that's so that just make sure you do that, and I'll probably be doing next video too, just showing off. But I think that's probably enough. For this episode, sorry this is a bit short, but I just want to keep this like a, a video just to set everything up. So if you want to skip these, you can, but I mean you miss up all the setting up and stuff. And I will go over a bit of the setting up, but not enough that you will get 100% what to do. Thanks for watching. See you next time.